So in my last video, I spoke on my investment in a crypto project called Titano. And in that video, I casually mentioned another investment that goes by the name of Libero. It was like this. Found a fork project called Libero. I put $300 in that as well. So Libero is a fork of Titano, which basically means it's a straight copy with some changes that the new developers decide are better options than the original. So for example, Titano's APY is over 102,000%. Well, Libero's is 158,893%, and uh, that's that's even more than a lot that I said in the in the last video. <sighs> Normally, most forks end up being a rug pull situation, and honestly, I don't know if Libero will be any different. The official site looks sketchy and corny to say the best. The tokenomics are not the best and there really isn't any original thought. Gone to much of it at all. The concept of Libero is purely based on the concept of building passive income and taking out a small percentage each day until you get your original investment back and let the rest ride. With that being said, let's have a quick look at the tokenomics. So 3% of purchases and 5% of sales go directly to the treasury, which supports the treasury. 5% of the buy and 10% sales fee are directed to the RFE fund, which helps sustain and back the staking rewards provided by the positive rebase. Now, Libero risk-free value, the RFE fund, is stored in BUSB and only going up exponentially at 50% per year by bridging multi-chain and farm at the best yield farms. The profit is used to further support the Libero price. Now, these numbers come straight from their site and I'm not sure if they're 100% up to date. It's also hard to find the community as the link for the Telegram doesn't work. They don't have a Discord and the Twitter interaction numbers don't really seem to add up with the amount of followers they have. Honestly, it's not looking too good so far, but let me tell you why I got into it. Basically, I'm not very smart and I do have a gambling addiction. So, I heard something that struck with me and felt like it could be the case with this project and that was, not only can you get rich from the good projects, but finding the number one fork project can also make you rich. So basically, there's normally one fork project that will also do pretty well off of the original one. And with the hype I saw of Libero, I felt like this could be a good fork project to ride the wave until it had a decent pump and get my original investment out. I did put $300 in and currently at the time of recording this, my balance is at $280. After the fees and everything, my $300 was worth about $260. So I guess technically I am up. $20, but also probably down $80. It's, it's confusing. So my original plan was once my balance was worth about $600 or double my investment, I'd take out the original investment and let the rest ride. Now, I've been in the project for about two weeks and uh, it's the most nerve wracking project I've been in, much more than Titano, because I feel like at least with that, it's got good developers and I think you know it's a original project that can stand on its own and uh, I do feel like Liberia is a bit of a ticking time bomb that could explode either way it could go up or down and the longer I hold it the more I want to get out and now I'm wondering if I should follow the guidelines for passive income which is that after 14 days you start cashing out 1% per day until you get your original investment back. I'll put up a visual and it has the whole three-step financial freedom guide and you can pause this video and have a quick read for yourself and see what you think. Now, I don't know what my future for my investment in Libero looks like, but I will make a follow-up video, that's for sure. And I do need to say that if you're interested in this project or any other, please, please, please do your own research and only invest what you can afford to lose. And if you are interested in following my journey of making $50,000 this year, using nothing but side hustles, apps and investing, do hit that subscribe button, ring the bell, like this video, and I appreciate y'all, I'll see you in the next one.